Hello, everybody. Welcome to our explanation of phenomenon number 13, coin magic. Okay, so how did Madeline pick the correct coin? Maddie and Maya will explain here. going to um, tell you some stuff about the magic coin trick. So. Okay, so Maddie, how were you able to figure out which one of those four Maya chose? Um, I felt the warmness in the coin. So you felt for the warmer coin and that let you know which one she had chosen out of those, yes. out of those four coins. Okay, so Maya, what do you have to say about that? Um... So, um, if I, when I picked it up and I held it for a long time and it put a, a lot of my body heat onto it hmm. and if I hadn't picked up the coin and I just pointed to the number, um, I, she wouldn't have been able to do the trick. Okay. So that's part of the magic trick. So we had to trick you into picking it up. Then we need to see... If we could get you to be fooled, then it seemed like it worked, but maybe next time it wouldn't work. Okay, so. Bye! See you later! Okay, so here's a little bit more detail with some nice pictures about what exactly was going on. So, when something heats up, its molecules move around more. So, those little circles, they represent molecules on the left, they're cold in blue. And once they get heated up, they start moving around a lot. And on the right, the red ones are hot and they're bouncing around all over the place. Now, with regard to the hand, heat is passed or transferred to the nearby molecules of the quarter from Maya's hand uh, by a process that is called conduction. And you can see those little circles moving around they go from being blue to being red and it kind of moves across from the left side of the screen to the right side of the screen now the molecules of the metal coin are packed tightly together in a pattern and this is what allows them to conduct um, the heat very well so metal makes a good conductor of heat now this trick would not work as well if the coins were plastic. Plastic is not a good conductor of heat because the molecules are not arranged in a tight pattern. So we've done some experiments in some labs with plastics and they have long tangled chains of molecules that don't really have a consistent pattern. Now back to our question. How did she pick the correct coin? So one quarter is warmer than the others because Maya was holding it. And Maddie held each coin in her hand and felt for the warmest coin. So in her skin, there's these little diagrams here that show the cutaway of the skin and the cells that are inside the skin. And if you look here, there are nerve endings in the skin that help detect heat. So this is what Maddie was using to feel for the warmest coin out of those four. And then she knew from that, that she knew which coin and which year Maya was holding the coin for. And that's it. Thank you very much for watching. I hope you can try this trick on your uh, family or friends at home. See you later.